Anyhow, so today we're here to honor one of our own, you know. Winning a World Series at any level is incredible. But when you're talking the World Series of ba Major League Baseball, that is the pinnacle. And I'm so proud of Kurt and what he's been able to accomplish. The years of dedication you've put forward, thank you for what you've done. I don't know why I know these things, but I know the feeling your family has. <laughs> I don't know why, but I do, you know? And so, you know, and, and, and Kurt stands out in many areas. You know, you know, Kurt is the only player from Maui to have not only a World Series in the Major League, but also a World Series championship collegiately. It's incredible that this island and the people of Maui County have had the pleasure of World Series champions on all levels, Little League, Senior League, you know, all the different levels now. It's really incredible. But it's a real testament to our community, the village that we are, that we support what you do. And now we will support your children in what they do. And I think that what makes Maui Nokoi, what makes Maui the best county. I am extremely, extremely proud as a as a parent, as a grandparent, that this young man has done probably what I call the impossible dream in some people's minds, but he's brought it to reality. And we cannot say thank you enough. This is a proclamation from the county of Maui, our people. I, Michael P. Victorino, mayor of the county of Maui, do hereby proclaim Friday, January 17, 2020, as Kurt Suzuki Day throughout the county of Maui. And thank Kurt for not only making the state proud on the biggest stage, but also giving, giving back to our local Maui community. Do I have to call you Mr. Mayor, Mr. Victorino, Uncle Mike? What? I call you Mr. Mayor, Mr. Mayor now, since you're the boss. But I would like to thank, you know, Mr. Victorino, the mayor and his staff for um, honoring me and my family here. Uh, I was very honored. Um, and to you, Keith, thank you so much for you and your staff and everybody here that uh, is here today. Thank you guys so much. It means a lot to me, my family, my son, my family in California. Um, this is a special time. Obviously, winning the World Series is, is a lifelong dream. Um, a short-term dream, too, when you start getting to baseball. When you watch the World Series on TV, and you watch these players celebrating and you kind of dream or think about maybe it could be me one day. And I always said it when I was there playing the World Series, I would pinch myself saying, I can't believe I'm playing the World Series. You know, I'm looking at the paint on the grass and, um, you know, just can't believe that I'm here um, from Wailuku playing at, you know, War Memorial Stadium. And now I'm playing in uh, the World Series. Uh, it's, it's very humbling because, you know, I never take anything for granted, you know, in, uh, in baseball, especially in life, um, you know, you can never take anything for granted. You have to enjoy every moment, be appreciative, because there is some luck that comes into it, too. It's not just the skill. It, it, things have to go your way. You have to have good support um, from my family, but also from you guys. You know, when I'm there playing, I know, when you know you got the whole island of Maui, the whole state of Hawaii behind you, it gives you that much strength, you know, you know, like, I am playing for the, I mean, I know a lot of guys don't think like that in California and stuff, because, you know, like Mr. Victorino said, it's, Maui's the best, it's a family, everybody, you know, when you come to Hawaii, you come to Maui, it's, it's a family, and, and when I play out there, I can feel the support, I feel the love, and it, it gives you that little extra, like, I don't know what it is, that jolt of energy, or, or what, but it gives you a little bit of a boost, and, um, I say it whenever I do interviews, the support that I get from the aunties, the uncles, everybody that supported me that I surround myself with growing up as a kid till I am now, it means a lot because without everybody here, this is a team, an island, a state effort. You know, it's not just me. I know I'm, you know, when I win the World Series, everybody says it's me, but it's not just me. It's everybody that I surrounded myself with that gave me the love and support growing up. So I want to thank you guys for that too. But, I mean, with that being said, you know, Mr. Victorino, you know this feeling. It's, it's a pretty satisfying feeling, you know, being, um, you know, the World Series, you know, Shane won it twice. And <clears throat> to, for me to be able to follow in, in the footsteps of Shane and to, to uh, become, you know, part of that family that 
wins the World Series and does it for your state, it's a pretty cool experience, you know. And, you know, he did it first. And as a player growing up, he's older than me always. And you want to follow in the footsteps and become, you know, as, as good as, you know, the people that come before you. And not just that, but uh, representing your state, representing the county, doing things to help out the kids and things like that. That's always been my goal is to, to be able to help and give back to the community that, that has given back to me throughout my whole life and the support that I've gotten. So um, with that being said, you got anything else to say, bud? <laughs> uh, I would like to thank, <laughs> thank you guys again. Um, you know, this is a huge day for us. Like I said, my parents are here and they've sacrificed a lot. So it's, uh, it's a pretty special time. So thank you guys. You want to read this one too first? Make sure it's all about what I said is said. It's good? You sure? Thank you, guys. Because without your approval, I'm in big trouble, right?